Good evening, everyone, and welcome back to Prophecy Box Breaks for one more treasure hunt. Tonight, we are looking at 2023 Bowman Best University Football. We have a draft event on our hands, four rounds encompassing almost all of the teams that you can find in Bowman Best. We had a couple leftovers. Those of you that are unaware, leftover teams are just going to be used as fillers for anybody who may not have necessarily hit the jackpot in today's break. Obviously, if one of those teams hits one of the autographs, that will go directly into the randomizer. We'll randomize amongst everybody that picked up teams, and we will simply go from there. All righty? We are not going to hesitate any much longer. We have been chatting. We've got a few folks in the live stream tonight. Thank you so much for making it. Definitely appreciate all of you keeping us company today. If you are checking us out down the road on YouTube, do me a favor, hit that like button down below, leave us a comment, let me know what hit you liked the most. We'd love to hear that feedback, always love to hear what people want to see from our breaks so that we can provide that a little bit better off in the future, and we're going to keep on ripping the best, awesomest, I don't know, cards that we can possibly find. Here we go. There are not a ton of packs, we got 12 packs to open. We're going to mix things up just a little bit here. And here we go. Pack number one. We have John Reese Plumley, UCF. Bronson Barron, Western Kentucky. Whoa, our first pack. First autograph, going to be the first tight end off the board. University of Georgia alum, star tight end, baby, Brock Bowers. Holy cow, what a phenomenal first pack pull, numbered 23 of 25. Wow. Wowee, if that is any indication of what we are going to find in this break today, holy cow. Wow. That's going to go directly into a sleeve here. We are going to protect that gem. Phil Maffa, Clemson. And Cooper Legas, Utah State. Whew. Oh my goodness. Crazy, crazy first pack. I should have had the uh, I should have had the checklist open, but I failed to do that. We sat here and talked for ten minutes before the break, and I forgot to load the checklist. That sounds like me. There we go. We said number to 25, right? Okay. Wow. Number to 25 is listed as orange refractor or orange geometric. Number to 25, one in five breaker. So I assume the orange geometric is only available in the breaker box. So this is gonna be your orange refractor. Beautiful hit, beautiful hit. Let's find at least three more. Man, what a first pack. Whew. What a first pack. Cade Klubnick, quarterback, Clemson. I don't know if you saw that, but I saw something. Anybody else see that? We have Caleb Downs, Alabama. Whoa. 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 We have Studio Stars, Joe Milton, quarterback, Tennessee. With perhaps a disco prism look here. Let's check for uh, not numbered. 
So looking at the checklist, this is your Speckle Refractor, found one in 54 hobby packs. So with 24, or excuse me, only 12 packs in a box. I mean, that's uh, almost uh, four boxes. So very nice, Speckle Refractor, University of Tennessee. And his gem number two, we have Johnny Wilson with the Silver Refractor. Florida State. Silver is not numbered. And Brady Cook for the Missouri Tigers. <coughs> Speckle Refractor is beautiful. Yeah, right? What first first couple of minutes here is just wonderful start. Going into pack number three here. Jackson Dart, Ole Miss. We have a Masterpieces Speckle Refractor for Caleb Williams, USC. We were just talking about Caleb Williams in the pre-break here, um, whether or not he was going to end up going to Chicago. And boy, oh boy, we t spoke him right into existence in today's break. Considering the Speckles were listed as one, what did we say, one in 54? One in 54 hobby packs, and we pulled two in the same box. A hundred packs of love right there. A hundred packs worth of love. Behind him. Dallas Turner, Alabama. That is your base or your silver refractor. Dante Moore, UCLA. And Jurion Dickey, Oregon. Pack number four. Wow, this pack feels really thick. I feel like we're going to have a, an autograph in this pack. We got Mario Williams, wide receiver, USC. Donovan Isuraku, Boston College. Richard Reese. And that is... That is beautiful. I'm going to go with a lava refractor, maybe? Let's take a look for a number that is not numbered. Let me make sure. Oh, no, pardon me. Pardon me. I missed it right there. Numbered 12 of 100 makes it a pink lava refractor found one in 30 hobby packs. Hit for uh, BU, that's, uh, I want to say Baylor? Baylor, yeah, Baylor. There you go. Trying to take a look. Baylor was a third round pick. Baylor was, yeah, bottom of the third pick. 23rd overall in our, in our, our, uh, our draft. Congratulations on your pull there, Drew. Nice find. Behind him, we have Javon Bullard, Georgia, and Tyler Buckner, Alabama. We haven't seen one. None of these have been first, huh? I thought maybe we'd find at least a couple, but no Bowman first. Nope, not yet. Okay. Aside from our autograph, that is our first numbered pull. We'll stand him up in the back there. 
probably actually bring this down just a little bit here. So it was definitely a little bit thicker with the numbered parallel in there. Uh, this should be pack number five. Although I just made a mess of my packs over here, my empties. We have Harold Perkins, LSU. There is your base, Caleb Williams, USC. Not quite as pretty as the Speckle Refractor. Whoop, whoop. Grant Wells, quarterback for Virginia Tech. That is numbered 37 of 150, which is a blue refractor found one in 22 hobby packs. Let's see, Va Tech. Looking Vatek looks like it's going into the randomizer. Double checking. Yeah. Vatek was not drafted. This will go into the randomizer. So we'll go ahead and put him aside here. We'll sleeve him up in just a moment. We have AJ Swan. That's Virginia, I believe. Vanderbilt, pardon me. Vanderbilt. And Keon Keeley, Alabama. I feel like we've seen more Alabama than anything so far, but their base. So Mr. Wells there will go into the randomizer at the end of our break. Love how the break started with a autograph and then none after. That's fun. Pack number six. Braylon Allen. Olu Fashanu. Uh, Allen is Wisconsin. Fashanu here is Penn State. Uh, I don't think I've ever done that before. Um, I, I guess we, woo, woo, we just pulled a second Brock Bowers autograph. Um, I don't, I don't, I don't think I've ever pulled. I mean, I get that it's a parallel, but I don't think I've ever done that before. In the same box, this one is not numbered, so this is your base refractor parallel. Hey, it's it's just a little unfortunate that there aren't four individual autographs, that's all. Um, I, I why, why wouldn't we woo was the question from chat, and you're absolutely right. We should definitely still celebrate. Awesome hits are awesome hits if we'd have pulled this one or that one alone, we'd be wooing. So I, I apologize. We should definitely be wooing. I was I was more so just shocked at the fact that we pulled we pulled two of them. Um, Brock's probably gonna go uh, yeah, I agree with you, Don, around number five or so. I don't I don't think there's any way that he lasts uh, that he lasts much farther than that. Uh, we'll go ahead and sleeve him up here in a moment. We have Mason Smith, L S U and there is your base, Brock Bowers. Georgia. Oh my goodness. If there's a mispack and all four are him, can you imagine? Be like, hey, I was going to put this video on YouTube, but I thought you might want to buy it from me instead and send me a new box or six. Doesn't save four different autographs. Justice Haynes, Alabama. JJ McCarthy, Michigan. 
now national champion J.J. McCarthy. Whoa, dual auto. Xavier Worthy, Texas, and Jatavion Sanders, also Texas, numbered 7 of 25. This is... I believe the first dual autograph we have ever pulled here at Prophecy Box Breaks. That is an absolute diamond. Wow. Wow. I'm absolutely taken aback. Um, I'm looking for... I'm just looking for it on the checklist here. There we go. Jatavion Sanders and Xavier Worthy, numbered to 25. Uh, there is also an orange refractor numbered to 25, but I would say this is the base numbered to 25. I get that there's a little bit of orange, but then you've got green down here as well. So dual autograph card and you don't even have to randomize it because it's going straight to Texas pulling up the draft drafted at number 25 the first spot of the third round of course Mr. Ryan Luter uh, these are sticker autos all four autographs so far there you go there you got a real good look there they are sticker autos But absolutely phenomenal. What a pull. What a pull. <sighs> Behind them, Ja'Cory Brooks from Alabama and Jaden Ott, Cal. Whew. Oh, my God. Ryan. Ryan, how do you do it? Show me how you do it. I'll go find another break, a, a group break, and I'll just do it there while we break. I won't, I won't, you know, nobody has to know. It'll be our little secret, okay? Just tell me, tell me how you do it. I'm going to take this one from back here because this is just, this card is just too sweet. It is just, this is just too sweet. I wonder, now does, it, does this mean, are we guaranteed four autograph cards, do you think? Do you think we'll get one more card with an autograph? Or do you think that this is our our guarantee of four autographs? <laughs> Ryan says, years of bad luck. No, if you're going to blackjack tables, it's me that you want there, Eric. But that's for another day. K.J. Jefferson, quarterback of the Arkansas Razorbacks. Chris Vezina, Clemson. Don is calling for Washington, and our next poll is a silver Emmett Moorhead for Boston College. We have Drew Pine, quarterback for Arizona State. And Kool-Aid McKinstry, who tons of people are currently mocking to land with the Houston Texans in the draft. Should be an interesting time nonetheless. I'm already excited, already ready for it. We're not even to free agency yet. I think this is pack number nine. I've kind of lost count. There is Mr. First Round Quarterback himself, Drake May. Jackson Arnold, Oklahoma. Whoa, we have a die cut. Wanted Malachi Starks from the University of Georgia. Wow. These wanted posters got even better than they were last year. I like the holographic team logo there on the bottom. You got that foil outline. What a pull. 
two autographs and an insert for the University of Georgia. They were not a team to sleep on in the draft. And yet, somehow, they fell all the way to number five. Man, that guy must have been a real smart fella to take the uh, take the Georgia Bulldogs and not let them fall any farther than that. Dallin Hayden, running back for Ohio State, and Paris Jones, running back for Virginia. We have three packs left. We're looking for one more autograph. Come on, baby. Dylan Gabriel, another quarterback for Oklahoma. Nico Amaleva, quarterback, Texas. We have yet another autograph. This is actually our fifth autograph of the break. Rome Odunzi, wide receiver for Washington, called by Mr. Don Fenton. That autograph is numbered 15 of 50. Uh, and that is the gold refractor. 15 of 50. Way to go, Don. Holy cow. Exactly what he wanted, he says. Congratulations on that pull. Washington tumbled down the draft board. Uh, I can't find him. Oh, to fourth. I, I thought, I really thought Washington was going to go second. Uh, they tumbled down to fourth. Don scooped him. The quarterback. Oh, the quarterback was Tennessee a moment ago. Oh, you're you're absolutely right. That is the Tennessee T, not the Texas T. My bad, my bad there. We will sleeve this up here. It is a beautiful gold. Smale Mondin Jr., linebacker, Georgia, and Marshawn Lloyd, running back, USC. Man, five autographs. Two packs to go. Absolutely amazing box. Damian Martinez, Oregon State. Dorian Singer, USC. Look at that. Drake May, Speckle. Gorgeous, gorgeous. The base speckle refractor, one in 12 packs. So one of these per box for the base. I have not got my hands on any Don Russ yet, Drew. I'll let you know if we are able to grab some. There were a couple of teams both trying to get at UNC. Only one of them could make it. Eric, congratulations on that pull. I am willing to bet that uh, Andrew will be in your DMs trying to trade you for this hit, brother. Good luck with that. Congratulations on your pull. Behind Mr. May, we have Carson Beck from Georgia and Blake Corum, Michigan. I know somebody very specific in today's break is looking for a Blake Corum autograph. While it looks like our luck may have run out, we're going to open this last pack and see if we can't just break those odds and get one more one more hit here one more numbered it was something we got Cameron Ward uh, I'm not positive about this I'm Washington State there we go Julian Fleming wide receiver from Ohio State we have our studious stars insert Emmett Moorhead Looks like Boston College. That is Boston College. That is a silver Studious Stars. And I think the second hit for Boston College. Yeah, we have a silver Emmett Moorhead uh, base up here. So you got a little double action. 
for your quarterback. Arand Gadsen the second for Syracuse. And Mr. Irrelevant of today's draft break, Justice Ellison, running back from Wake Forest. So, boy, oh boy, this was a, a rather big break for us. It was a little on the spendy side, but it was definitely worth it in the end. Lots of phenomenal pulls, a couple of lava, three speckles, three pulls for the Georgia Bulldogs, and a double hit for the Texas Longhorns. Thank you so much for being part of the Prophecy Box Breaks family. Be on the lookout for our next break announcement coming this Friday. And have yourselves a great week, everyone.